I mean, if someone walked by me with the first one, I'd probably have to stop and turn around. <laughs> yeah, it smells pretty good. Cue the music. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Andrea, also known as Curly Sense, and thank you so much for stopping by. Well, ladies, fall is here. And that means we can finally bring out the darker, more seductive, and more delicious perfumes. Not to mention his gray sweatpants season. Can I get an amen? In, today <laughs> In today's video, I'm bringing you another reaction bottle, which includes two highly requested perfumes that just so happen to be absolutely perfect for the cooler weather. Versace Crystal Noir EDT versus YSL's Libra Intense. For those of you who haven't seen my previous videos, basically what we do here is find beautiful, unsuspecting men in the streets, have them smell the perfumes, and let us know which one they will find more attractive on a woman. Also, make sure to stick around until the end of this video if you'd like to hear my own thoughts on these two perfumes and which one I will personally recommend. Let the battle begin. Here's the first one. Okay. And here's the second one. Which one is sexier? I think the first one is probably sexier. I think the second one smells like sunscreen. Okay, all right. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay, so here's A. Okay. All right. And here's okay. B. Which one would you like to smell on a woman? I think B. I think I like B, B a little more. Yeah. B, all yeah. right. And if you were to give it a rating from 1 to 10? I'd give B like an 8 or a 9. 8 or yeah, 9? Yeah. I, I like the smell. It's yes, good. thank you so yeah, much. No problem. Thank no you. Problem. And the second one. Which one do you think is sexier for a woman? Hmm. I like that one. That one's a little more subtle, makes you want to get a little closer. Mm -hmm. Second one. So the second one, if you were to give it a rating from 1 to 10? Probably 10. 10 out of 10! Yes! Thank you so much! You're just gonna spray them like, like what's going on? Okay, so here's the first one. Okay. And here's the second one. Which one do you think is more attractive for a woman? I don't know, probably the second one. The second one? Yeah, the second one. Okay, for and sure. what would you rate the second one from 1 to 10? I don't know, probably like a, probably a 6. A six out of ten? Yeah. But you like it? Yeah. It's okay. Not bad. It's okay. not the best thing I've ever smelled. But it's all good. Fair enough. Thank yeah. you. There we go. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna switch it up for you. Don't don't listen to your friend. Okay. All right, all right. <laughs> okay. And here's the second one. Which one is the best? Definitely first. Definitely the first. And if you were to rate the first from one to ten? Thirteen out of ten. Thirteen out of ten, ladies. You hear that? 13 out of 10. Here's the first one. Okay. It's pretty nice. pretty nice. And the second one. Okay. Which one do you like the most? I'd say second one. Second one. Second one yeah. Okay, and if you were to rate the second one from 1 to 10? I like the second one like 8.5. Eight 8.5? And and That's amazing. Okay. Thank you so much. Perfect. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Hee 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 which one is sexier for a woman? I need I need around two. Got it. Okay. And the second one. I think the first one. I the first it. one? Yeah. Uh, what would you rate the first one from one to ten? Um, I think eight. Eight. That's a good. Ah, uh, you wanted to give eight point. <laughs> eight point three. <laughs> That's my rating. All right. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, you're welcome. Ladies, so far Libre is kicking some. Yes. It's kicking butt. How do you feel about that? I don't know how I'm feeling. Versace is my, my baby. Gotta get them points up. Okay. And the second one. Which one is better? I think I like the first one. The first one? Yeah, yes. It's a, it's a little stronger. Yes, yes. And if you were to give it a rating from 1 to 10? Uh, 8. 8 out of 10? Yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much. Of course. Okay, I like that. Mm -hmm. And the second one? Okay. Which one is the best? I like the second one because it's a little soft. It's like a nicer, but yeah, the second one's, I mean, the first one's a little too strong for my liking. I feel you 100%. <laughs> From one to 10, what's your rating for the second uh, one? It's solid, solid eight out of 10 for perfect, me. Perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. All right, yeah, of course. <laughs> so here's the first one and the second one. Which one is better? Second one for sure. Second Definitely one second for one. sure. Yeah. And if you were to give it a rating from one to 10? Uh, 
like an eight or nine. Yeah, I would say. I mean, I don't. I'm not an expert on fragrances, so. But it, your opinion matters 100%. So, ladies, eight or nine out of ten for the second one. Thank you. Awesome. All right. What? Sorry. And the second one. I like the second one better. You like the second one better, just like your friends. Mm -hmm. And if you were to give it already a rating from one to ten, what would it be? Se seven and a half. Seven and a half. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you so All much. Right. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. And here's the good. second one. Which one do you prefer? Give me another go around. Yeah. Yeah. I like that one. I like them both, but I like that one the best. Yeah. That's a good one. <laughs> That's good. And if you were to rate this one from one to ten, what would it be? Eight and a half. Eight and a half. Yeah. Okay. Solid. Thank you so much. Cool. Oh, that smells good. Yeah. Yeah, that smells good. <laughs> and the second one. Which one do you prefer? I like the first one more. Yeah? I do. Okay, and if you were to give it a rating from 1 to 10? I mean, if someone walked by me with the first one, I'd probably have to stop and turn around. <laughs> yeah, it smells pretty good. That's good, that's good. So what is it, from 1 to 10? Um, I'd say like a 9.5. 9 out of 10. Yeah. 9.5, ladies. 9.5 out of 10. Thank you so much. Okay. And the second one. Okay. Which one is sexier? I like the first one better. You like the... Yeah. Wait, which one was the first one that I did? <laughs> that one? one? Yeah, this yeah, one was yeah. the first one? Yeah. Oh, from 1 to 10, what would you give it? I'm sorry. As a rating. That's nice. I'd say like a 7.58. 7.58 yeah. out of 10. That's Thank awesome. you so much. No problem. Have a good one, guys. <laughs> you too. Bye. <laughs> All right. So I have two fragrances here. You are the last <laughs> candidate for today's video. Curly Sense, I really love your channel. <laughs> I'm so happy that you could have me today on Thank the street. Thank you so much. Ready to smell? I'm ready. So here's the first one. Oh, oh my god. And here's the second one. Which one is the best? All right, guys. So obviously, I know what these are already. Versace Crystal Noir is my baby. One of my all-time favorite women's perfumes. That's a 10 out of 10. That one wins. I think Libra won this video, and I could definitely see why. It's like a 9.5 out of 10. It's sweet. It's seductive. It's super powerful. So you can't go wrong either way. Thank you. So there you have it, the men have spoken once again. And as you can see, this matchup was a complete massacre. You probably noticed by my facial reactions that I was hoping Crystal Noir will do a little bit better. But the clear winner here was Libra Intense. Now, if you've been watching my channel for a long time now, you already know that Crystal Noir is one of my most worn and most complimented fragrances. Man, it's such a seductive, coconutty, floral, and spicy scent that always makes me feel so confident and sexy every time I put it on. It's clean, yet mysterious, which makes it perfect for evenings out or a date night. I've also gotten some over-the-top reactions from men, but I guess this particular men just weren't feeling it. Now, Libra Intense is one that I kind of put on the back burner when I first smelled it, but after buying a sample of it for this video and then witnessing the reactions from men, let's just say that I have a, a full bottle coming in the mail. <laughs> so yes, influencers can be influenced as well, and there is nothing wrong with that, okay? This is a warmer, creamier version of the original with less of that lavender and more deliciousness coming from vanilla and tonka bean. It's also very powerful and leaves an incredibly sensual and addictive scent trail. I highly recommend both of them and I can't wait to wear them in the upcoming weeks. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Let me know, have you tried any of these two perfumes or which one of the two is your favorite? See you soon.